All right, there's been a lot of people requesting to see a better video of the Harbor Freight welder and mainly the the modification I did for it to hold a 10 pound spool of wire. So here's just you know a quick overview of it again. It's the Easy Mig 100, uh, 90 amp on high output and 80 amp on minimum output. Uh, 10 percent duty cycle and 90 amps, 11 on uh, 80. 120 volts, single phase, 60 hertz, 24 amps. And that's what the little thing there says. <coughs> um, it's been a great welder in the time that I've had it. Uh, I've had it a little over a year now, and I've been running the spool like this for about six months. And everyone's asked me, has it wore off the little wire feed motor in it yet? No, it is not. It still pulling it great it works fine so um yeah um to get this uh the 10 pound spool in it like i have i like i already built this cart and then i decided to try to do this and so i don't know if y'all want to build one of these carts i mean i just built it around the welder basically but um 10 or 10 pound spool of lincoln wire um all I did was drill one quarter inch hole in the back of the welder um, and you know about this cart and it's got two two by fours coming off of it a piece of five eighths round stock going through there and a pair of cheap vice grips to keep the spool from shifting over that way but um yeah works great it you know I mean if you're first starting out welding you got to be careful because I messed up a few times and laid my leads on a few pot, hot pieces of metal and melted them there, but uh, still works great. There's nothing wrong with them, but uh, yeah. And the ground clamp, it wasn't uh, on there very tightly, so I pinched it tighter and wrapped it in electrical tape. But I'm all I did. I trash picked all this wood for the cart. And it's got lawnmower, like high wheel lawnmower back wheels, and the mountain brackets. Just cut them up with my grinder to make them fit right. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I think it's about like 40, uh, it's like 44 or 46 inches tall. The whole cart, like to the top of the handle up here. Um, I've just got a little thing to hold my wire brush, chip and hammer. My helmet can go there too. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to cut this video because it's freezing out here. It's like uh, 30 degrees out here, and my light up there isn't working. I don't know. Well, it never works in the cold. And uh, so, yeah, there's the Harbor Freight Welder. See y'all later.